An inmate told authorities he planned to kill a prison guard who he says disrespected him. Video released today shows how he carried out that sneak attack inside the state pen. Here's News 13's Marissa Lucero with that video. Marissa. Dean, three inmates had a plan. They were only out of their cells for less than a minute when two of them went after the guard with a homemade shank. Now we want to warn you, some of the video may be difficult to watch. It's just after 10 in the morning at the state pen earlier this month. Two guards are releasing inmates for recreational time. Level six, the tier that houses the worst of the worst violent offenders. The same pod that houses inmates Lorenzo Martinez, Joe Martinez, and Carlos Mendez. Lorenzo and Joe both have histories of attacking jail guards, while Mendez is serving a 12 year sentence for attempted murder and kidnapping. That's Mendez talking with one of the guards. More cell doors open, and Lorenzo Martinez steps out. He puts his arms up so the guard can pat him down, but when he steps forward, he immediately puts both hands inside his shirt. That's when Joe Martinez makes his move. Investigators say Mendez kept the guard talking as a distraction and within seconds it appears he removes something from inside his waistband and attacks the guard with a knife. Lorenzo joins in. The guard falls to the ground then Lorenzo goes after the other guard. Investigators say a third corrections officer watching from an observation deck fired three rounds from a less lethal shotgun sending the inmates flying to the ground and ultimately ending the attack. All three inmates are charged with attempted murder. They told investigators the weapons they made were used from pieces of a steel fence and a metal door. Two of the inmates were moved to the segregation unit. Back to you, Dean. All right, Marissa, thank you. Those two guards were treated and released from the hospital the day of the attack. They are expected back to work tomorrow.